time to go for gold here in Medellin at the fourth stage of the Hyundai Archery World Cup. It's an all Korean final and there is a huge amount at stake here. First, let's go and meet the athletes. Bags and bags at stake here. Not only a stage win up for grabs, but this is a straight shootout between two Koreans for the second Korean spot in the Hyundai Archery World Cup Finals, taking place in Mexico in October. Chef, this is a pressure match. Yeah, it is, and uh, I think both are very deserving of that spot. Um, but besides the fact that, yeah, there's only two Koreans allowed to go to the World Cup Final. That's just what the rules are like. Choi Mi Sun already qualified by winning in Guangzhou. And San gets the match underway with a nine. It's been a feature of uh, the semi finals and finals, shooting a nine first. Oh, that's close though. Has that cut the line? Yeah, that one. Uh, <laughs> so far, I've uh, called all of them in or out. Uh, Pretty uh, consistently, but now this one I uh, I don't dare. Too close to call, even for Dutch Olympian chef Van der Berg. Another close one. Yeah, she just, I think she likes to tease us a bit with this. So, uh, hard to call this one. 29 definitely from Hansan. We don't know whether this is 20 or 18. Oh, well, that's gone high. Now, that uh, has that stayed in the nine? It hasn't. It has. I think it has, but... Oh, it's marked as an eight on the scoreboard, so we we need to wait for all three yeah. arrows to be measured here for uh, Lee. Two close nines. One, perhaps, the first one, are perhaps, more likely to get called a 10. And that would give her, what, 27. See, it's definitely a nine, the last one. Yep, definitely a nine. Now, two arrows to measure here. Difficult camera angle, that's better. Chef, yeah, oh, top one down, bottom one up, just as we thought. I don't know if that meant nine or 10, or if he meant the bottom one is a 10, or the top one is a 10, so. So now the, the judges point at the arrows, and they have to do a signal to say whether they're marking the value up or down. So he pointed at the top arrow and pointed down, and the bottom arrow he pointed up. Okay, so that would mean a 28 down. in that case. And uh, it was a 29 from An San. So An San with a two set point to nil lead. And the advantage is with her. Well, this has started better for the triple Olympic champion, so it will be Lee ga -hyun to start set number two. Don't rule out a comeback and a fight back straight away. Oh, but another eight. Yeah, she's been, uh, her first arrow was like pretty much on target, uh, just a little bit to the right, and then she's just been hitting higher and higher. Oh. Oh. And San marked with an eight, with an asterisk, which means it goes to a measure. I think we're starting to see the nerves playing a part here. Yeah, she's maybe not moving her side enough. I don't know if she was going to still move her side more, but judging by what I just saw, I don't think she's she's just adjusting her side enough. Let's find out if she's made a better correction. She has there for a confirmed 27. And I think my, my gut feel says that it's a 26, that the 8 will not be upgraded to a 9, but... Well, let's see. 
because this is critical. This uh, another measure, two hours measured in the uh, first one for Lee, one in the second set for An San. Let's have a look. That does look like. Yeah, it's an eight. They they don't even take the magnifying glasses out. They just uh, pointed it, and I think that means that it's clear that it's an eight. So said don't rule out a fight back and then we saw Lee shoot an eight and thought this one was going to run away from her but uh, and has, uh, well given us the opportunity to see a proper match up here uh, I've got to say I think nerves are playing a part here yeah I was I was about to say the same thing uh, Ansan had Averaged a 29 in the semi-final, and now she is uh, uh, shooting eight. Uh, so yeah, I think there is definitely more nerves on this match than on the previous. Well, having battled their way through a week of uh, qualification, these two have made it through to the final. But it's still a huge pressure match here between the two Koreans. Start of the third. And An San is on the shooting line. That looked like a really clean shot, but I think she might want to give her a side even more uh, clicks to the right. An San getting some uh, some tips from uh, Park Sung Hyun, uh, one of the archery legends, uh, who is now turned the Korean coach. So, a 27 chance here for Lee to take the lead. into the eight. This is an incredible match. A 26 plays a 27. And it's two Koreans in the box. And San has just re-established a two-point lead. Yeah, so this is the second time we see an eight uh, at a critical moment from uh, two Koreans. So this is a uh, very um, different than what we're normally seeing from them. Incredibly unusual here. But... Uh, it speaks of the gravity of this match. Yes, it's a stage win, of course, and everybody wants it, but the added pressure, and, and arguably for these two, the more important factor in this is the winner goes to the finale. The loser, and this is where the pressure comes from, doesn't go anywhere, not even the top step of the podium in Colombia. Yeah, I think uh, this match has such a, such a pressure on it because I mean, they're so close, they can almost taste the tacos already. Are you hungry, Chef? Maybe. Yeah. Start of the fourth set here. An San won the first, Lee won the second, and San won the third. So Lee shoots first in the fourth. Much more like what we're used to. Yes. And of course, they both find the middle of the target at exactly the same time. Boy, this is tense. Yeah, so regardless of if they're shooting uh, really well or not so well, I feel like they're kind of in the same, uh, in the same ballpark uh, the whole time. All of a sudden, An San has control. Fancy Lee needs a 10 here. She gets just that for a 29, her highest score in a set so far. But the Colombian title and a place in the World Cup final at stake. A 10 is needed. A 10 is got. A perfect score from An San, the triple Olympic champion just when it was needed for a 6-2 victory. She's taken the stage win here in Medellin and with it, booked her place in the Hyundai 
Archery World Cup Final.